<clears throat> if you've ever gone to an elementary school or a junior high or a high school or a college, you'll know that there's a certain class of people that administrate those institutions. They're usually really kind of gray people, people who don't have a lot of artistic merit. People are interested in numbers and organization and making everything, you know, just so, and anything that fits outside those parameters is suspect to them because their chief function is to keep the organization from getting sued and to pull down their enormous salaries so that they can retire someplace and have somebody explain to them how they've wasted their lives being administrators. Be that as it may, I found that one of the difficulties our society is encountering is that most of the people who run institutions in our country, not just colleges and schools and high schools, junior highs, etc., but Large corporations and political organizations and service organizations and manufacturing companies are all administrators. What's happened is, is these people, they came up through school and they sat in class very quietly and they resented all the other kids who were having a good time and goofing off and maybe drawing or singing or painting or playing music. They resented them because those kids had friends and they had creativity and they seemed to be smiling a lot. And these administrators said, I'm gonna get even with them. And so they spent their entire educational careers amassing degrees of power. And it was like a voodoo witch doctor in some ancient Ancient tribe, they wield this power on a stick and they say, we are going to cut your budget. We're going to lay you off. We're going to find a way to be proactive. <laughs> and they're running the country. And what's happened is the country's going right into the toilet because they have no creativity or imagination or vision of the future because they're still getting even with all that crap that happened in the past when somebody stole their lunch money. Well, this is a message to all you administrators. We're not dead yet. And we're going to push you down once and for all. And we're going to do it with rubber clown noses and big shoes and pies in the face. And you'll never know what hit you because you shut off your brain years ago. So look for us. We're out here. We're coming.